Hello and welcome to another evening of Square World. This evening, Matt and I are back on the wonderful secret world. So what are we doing this evening, Matt? Tell the wonderful viewers. Today, we're going to complete the first investigation you see in the game called the Kingsmith Code. And provide a walkthrough as we go along. Hopefully, if we can work it out. <laughs> Um, I've not played this out, one. Indeed. Have, have you so, played this one, Matt? I have completed this one, yeah. Oh, so we kind of got an advantage. I, I haven't got a clue what we're doing. So, let's get started. Henry Hawthorne said the founding fathers of Kingsmith left clues to forgotten secrets all over town. Follow the traces of Illuminati. Well, I already know there are two red <laughs> Illuminati symbols out here on the church. Don't die on me. Mm-hmm. But they're pointing straight up and we can't fly, so... So they're pretty useless then. Yeah. Let's have a look nowhere around there. outside. Naturally, he's not actually going to tell me what to do. He's just going to let me guess. And when I get it wrong, he'll tell me I'm an idiot. <laughs> yeah, indeed. Right, Illuminati, Illuminati, Illuminati. Am I allowed a hint? Keep an eye out for something outlined in yellow, by the way. <laughs> um... This? Bloody great big drain. <laughs> <laughs> Never mind. What? Lux? Umini? Something up there can't read. I have no Lux idea what that means. Vincent. I think but it means pointing light in that direction. or light always wins. I'm assuming because it's pointing in that direction we have to head in that direction. Indeed. There's another one here, look. Oh! The street. Oh, one sees. Oh yeah, probably good thing to run. So yeah, still pointing down. Mm -hmm. Still pointing down. Show you on the map where we're going. Straight down Main Street by the look of it so far. Right, so straight down Main Main Street. <laughs> yep, straight down Main Street and looks like we have a turn. Oh bloody hell, what have I done? We've annoyed a few people. <laughs> okay. Uh, yep, yeah, and then along da, 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 Belmont Avenue. <laughs> I love the map feature. <laughs> and, and down here onto the pier, I think. Down that way onto the pier, yeah. Is it going onto the pier? And it looks like we have to fight yeah, our way through yeah. a Dr. Manhattan who's really let himself go, so. <laughs> <laughs> These aren't too bad, though. These are quite easy, to be fair. They're quite easy monsters. Even at this level, of us. where I suck. Yep, carry on straight We've down got up here. We've got quite decent skill um, setups already, so... We'll get there, we'll get there. We'll have to do a build video when we finally get our perfect build. <laughs> right, so... Yep, carry on straight down. Kill it's every the chaos shotgun is actually whatever these things are called. Figer inhalers. I love the way you say Figer. 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 Right now we seem to have lost the trail. <laughs> We've lost the trail, Matt. That's okay. I'm just happy to kill things for the time being. Oh no, we found the trail. Yeah, yeah we found the trail. Downed Marine Mariner. Jesus Christ, I'm such an idiot. Cool. Drowned Mariner. Some of these enemies are called Ancient Mariners, and I think that's quite a nice reference. So, somewhere around here. Indeed, it's pointing right here. Move out of the way. In the seat of power, the navigator immortalized. Okay, find the location referenced in the message. Oh dear god, you're kidding me. We have to go out to the lighthouse, yeah? Um, no, I don't think so. 
In the seat of power, the navigator immortalized, illuminating the path to the sleeping priest and Fletcher. That doesn't yeah. really... In the seat no. of power, that doesn't really talk about a lighthouse. No, I was looking more at the image. Uh, seat of power. I don't think the image is the key. Uh, well, what is Let, Let's take the first line in that one. Say the seat of power. So is there like a mayor's office or a... A police well, station, or something we can go to. Sheriff's place, isn't there? Yeah, the sheriff's, There's the sheriff's office at the start. So I'm guessing that's it. Yeah, good deal. Let's go it. back up there. I love the way you're playing the uh, Almighty God here at the moment. <laughs> 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 the all-knowing, all all-seeing, powerful entity that is Matthew Falconer. <laughs> <laughs> So, working on the assumption that currently I am correct, you then head to the mayor's office. There's a group of zombies back here. Chris, I think I found a rare zombie. Deviate a little bit. Oh, bloody hell. What's, what's a rare zombie? No, not, not really. What's this? Did you bring me in here deliberately? You brought me in here yes. deliberately. Where? Are, what? What is this place then? Is this a courthouse? This is the town hall. Oh, such a git. Such a git. Right. Okay. <laughs> so you go halfway up Main Street and into the town hall, which isn't actually labelled as the town hall, and you investigate paintings. Mm -hmm. There is nothing here. Do these randomised, do you know? There's a clue in some of them. Uh, I can no longer find the location reference clue, because I think you saw it and I haven't. Check this one. And um, none of them, e they're not yellow anymore. What's your clue? I don't know. Oh, show image, yes I do know. That's tier one, tier two. Find the location reference by the clue. I I can't actually see any. Think. No, you no. you just clipped. You just checked a painting and you got another clue. Which painting uh, was it? The one down here. This one. What does it say? I don't know because it won't let me activate it again. Then you should be able to check your image again if you go into the quest. Could there be a pearl in the mouth of a clam? Is this a clue? There's only one way to find out. Pearl in the mouth of a clam? Any ideas? Say that as a no. <laughs> pearl in the mouth of a clam? Let's have a look. Let's have a look. What have we got? Uh, it's obviously down at the docks or something. Pearl in the mouth of a clown. I don't I do what I Why, what's yours? Mine's the right one. Not the red herring that you've picked up by mistake. <laughs> well, you didn't tell me to go to the right one. So there's several ways of doing the same quest. No, there are th um, three sets of randomised clues which send you to the wrong direction and back to the town hall again. Then there's the right one, which is the painting I checked with the guy with the quill. Okay. Uh, Alright, well, let's think this through. Ignore a clue. Let's go check a phone book and see all the names of businesses and stuff in here, because one of them's got to be a clam reference. See, 
This is Matt thinking on the spot. I'd never even think of that. I just wander around aimlessly for the next three hours trying to find a clue. Trying to find something that glowed yellow. <laughs> Moral of the one. story. Don't do what I do. <laughs> Well, the wild, defrayed and some medical surprise, Dunwich newspapers, flags, Franklin... There's the lobster museum. trap. The lobster trap, the king of books. You've got the lobster track. Or different something or anything and some marine supplies. Kingsworth Town Hall, Fire Department... Pam Lake. the Clam, there you go. 10 Pam Arkham Clam, Avenue, no. Pam the Clam. I can't see Pam the Clam on this page. I've got it on mine. 10 Arkham ah, Avenue. Indeed I can. Where's Arkham Avenue then? Uh, da, 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 we're on it. Oh, we're on it. So we want to look at 10. This is so, so well made. How do we know what number's which? Uh, there's a building here. Found it. Oh dear God. You're kidding me, right? It's that thing there. That's cool. That is so, so clever. <laughs> right, back to Town Hall uh, and then you can show me the right painting. You get Mr. Smith and Wesson to help you out with that one. Right, which painting is it then that I'm supposed to look at? It's this painting here with this guy. <laughs> Okay, so far right corner people, don't do what I did and send us on a red herring. You should get the clue, um, time is the realm of gods and kings, look at the truth written in the words of, truth written by kings in the words of God or something. Yeah, the path is open to the enlightened. Enlightened. So... Let's get really nerdy. Time, time is the province of kings and gods. The hands of time point to truths. Uh, point to truths, written by kings in the words of God. The path is open to the enlightened. Now, um, I, I, knew, I knew this without finding a, a walkthrough when I first played it through. Um, I did use a walkthrough later on, but the Bible has a passage called Kings. Yeah. So, truths written in Kings in the words of God is probably a passage out of Kings in the Bible. Yeah, or it could be King's Bridge. What does that have to do with the words of God, though? No idea. Okay, it's the hands fine, of we'll time. go. Let's have a look at a clock. Well, there's going to be one on the church or one on here, isn't there? And there's a clock up here, just above this door. Yep. And it says ten past ten, or that's ten two. Uh, so let's use the web browser. Yeah, it's ten past ten, so ten ten. Let's see what Kings ten colon two turns up. Google. Oh crap! Let me do that. Arriving at Jerusalem. With a very great caravan, with camels carrying spices, large quantities... She came to Solomon and talked to him about what she had on her mind. Bingo. She came to Solomon. Do we know anywhere I was where just a guy called Solomon, Solomon lived? This is Solomon Island. I can't remember where it was. Let's go and check a phone book again. Oh, zombies. No, because we did it earlier and I can't remember where Solomon is. I tell you what though, that's Solomon never would have got that. Hmm? Never would have got that, that's ingenious. No wonder people are struggling with this. <laughs> right, okay, let's check so a right. phone book and see if there's anything with Solomon in it. Oh, oh for the love of God. Bugger off. I am trying to learn. <laughs> I'm having nice little Tom fun! <laughs> Solomon, 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 Solomon. 
Creed Brothers. Okay, and what's this over here? Oh look, you used to live here. <laughs> How did you know that? Oh yeah, Solomon Priest. How did you know that? Hey, that's some more. Right, okay, so we're here. Hang on a second. Well, the door's locked, let's go around the back. Yeah, it's gonna head. I always head straight around the back anyway. Oh, for the love of God. Basement. Now, there's a keypad here we can use. Right, but we don't have a code. Well, there's a, there's only one sequence of numbers that's been important to this quest so far. 10-2. No. Yeah, 10-2, isn't it? That doesn't work. Oh, okay. Let's go back around the front a set and just check the sign. Sixteen sixty seven to sixteen eighty two. Anything else on there? No. No, Solomon Health. There's a 730 as well. Oh, there it is. What's the code? It's 120 for some reason. Why 120? Was he 120 years old? No. no. Why 120? Oh, it's a solo instance now. Oh, Jesus, now I am screwed. <laughs> I have to admit, I love the artwork on this. So good. Mm -hmm. Right, okay. Enter the basement. Use the computer. Do my best. Okay, input password or type hint. Hint. As the famous Solomon priest said once once said, light conquers all. Oh, that was on the manhole covers, wasn't it, in Latin? Yes. It was. So let's try that then. Lux Omnia sit. I don't know how the hell you know all this, but I'm gonna run with it. Oh, it works. No, 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 no. <laughs> Lux. Did you leave? Did you do spaces as well? Spaces and capitals. You don't have to use capitals. Oh, don't you? One. Safe being open. Please stand clear. Cool. That is absolutely ingenious. And that's quest complete, I think, isn't it? Yeah. For this one, yeah. There we go, boys and girls. That is how you complete <laughs> the Kingsmith Code, apparently. <laughs> what do we get? Oh, usual stuff. Cool. Well, thank you very much, Matt, for showing me that. I think. No thank problem. you very much we for showing me that go on to the next one called Something Wicked, which is one I haven't done before. Next. Oh, okay. I'm so screwed. I'm so screwed. <laughs> right. Well, look out for our next tutorial video. As always, if you like, please rate, comment, subscribe, blah, 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 social interactive media, all the usual stuff. <laughs> and uh, we will see you in the next video. Yep. Goodbye. Ah, there we are.